Hello everyone and welcome back to Tech the Entertainment Kit. My name is Tim and today we're going to be continuing our Pokemon Sword Nuzlocke challenge. Uh, we just beat this guy right here in the last episode, so we gotta go up the hill and fight all these other trainers. Um, today, ooh, bear tick. Today is actually the 21st for me, but the 27th for you guys when you guys see this going live. So tomorrow will be the first day that I will be gone um, on my little mini vacation. Um, so, I've got a huge backlog stored up, which is good for me. But let's battle this guy. I am something, he says. We're gonna take on Darmanaton fight. Fire play edge. Ice is so good to fight with Charizard. Uh, Timmy level 51. How many Pokemon does he have? He's got a Phalanx. He's got one more after this. Air Slash should handle the Phalanx. Done. I just realized like how over leveled I am. Leon's 50, Fluffy's 50. Beautiful. And a grab locked. Which I'm disappointed that it's not water fighting. I'm gonna be real. Unless it is water fighting and I'm going insane. But I'm pretty sure it's just fighting. Which is like, eh. Is there even a water fighting type Pokemon? Now that I think about it, I don't think there is. Um, no. We will not be keeping Leon out front for this one because they not being randomized and all, have um, Helioptile and Clink Clank. Yeah. Heliolisk. And Clink Clank. Okay. Uh, Pam... Let's try a superpower on Clink Clank. And a draining kiss on Helios. Heliolisk. Why would you try mud slapping? Alright, whatever. Accuracy fell, stamina, defense rises. Stamina, defense rises. Wait, isn't Gear Grind a multi turn? No, it's not. It is! Oh boy. Oh boy. Hit twice. Draining kiss on the Heliolisk. Does nothing. Superpower. Clink clink avoided. Well, that's something. Fluffy heals himself up anyway, so. Um, let's try a Mega Kick on the Heliolisk and a Dazzling Gleam. Mud Slap on Pam. Fluffy's gone. I don't know my types very well. <laughs> Pam can't hit anything right now.
Come on out, my big boy. Let's try Mega Kicking again. I think Breaking Swipe hits both, so we're going to do that. Pam keeps on getting mud slapped out of accuracy. Attacks fell. Yeah. Take that. Shift gear. Which is a setup move. Ooh boy. Speed and tack. I don't think uh, Pam is going to hit anything in this fight. Unless we EQ, which we don't want to do because we'd have to have something flying or levitate out here. Let's just go with a heavy slam and a breaking swipe. I like how it's hurting himself more than it's hurting me. And they're really trying to keep my accuracy down. And Clink Clink and Heliolisk at the same time are down. That's a win. That's a hard win. And that's Fluffy down. Yeah, I forgot about that. Wait, why are we being buffeted? Oh! Uh, um... I think we just swap Pam out to Tim. And... Breaking Swipe's gonna be super effective on Noivern because Noivern is Dragon. Okay, I think I think that's gonna handle Noivern pretty easily. I don't know Togemaru, I think it's just electric steel. Iron barbs, huh? Tickle a little bit. All right. Um, tailwind to set the speed. Smart move. He knows he's going down. That, however, was not. I'm breaking swipe to take out the Noivern, and I think now Revenge should handle Togunamaru the rest of the way. Ooh, I got a sneeze coming. The sneeze gone. Well, meant to have my mic muted for that, too, but, you know... There's that, I guess. And there's Togunmaru gone. Tim's gonna take some damage from the iron bar. Tim's okay. Uh, Duraladon leveled, Guzma leveled. Yeah, so first thing we have is Fluffy. Give me your leftovers. Fluffy died. Now,
Let's see, who can I move? So we could put him on. Snow cone. Ice. Oh, no, can't put him on. Can't put him on. No. Yes, but over leveled still. Um, I don't think we have dark, so all my dark mons could go on. Thrusty boy could go on. So it's from these options here. Shenotic is grass and fairy. Illuminate. Astonish, Mega Drain, Absorb, Dazzling Gleam. That's not a bad move set. I wouldn't mind Shenotic. I actually think I really want a grass type. And I, honestly, I'm just going to put Ice on. I think Ice is going to be the best choice here because um, because of the type coverage. Even though like there's Fairy here, the Grass and Ice, even though it's going to give us more weakness to Fire, which is double now, we have answers for Fire with Guzma and uh, well, just Leon if we want, or Pam, or even Tim. Tim could handle Fire. But Ice is going to be good. Um, I am going to need to go heal, or, let me see here, let me hyper potion up Pam real quick, I'm going to walk up here, oh no this isn't another encounter, this is the town, Yeah, okay. I'm going to go into the town, and we will um, heal up here. I'll pause, fly down to the wild area, get myself some experience candies from a den. I think one should be enough. And then we get to move on to the Winden Gym Stadium thing. Wish I could cut the cutscene. I won't waste too much time, Hop. I won't. I promise. Um, I actually don't think I need to do that. Let's just town map. Um, let me see here. I like rain. Let's go here. See if we have any, um, things. So the nearest one is this side, down here it looks like, or maybe on this side, I don't know. Yeah, we'll go to this side. Palpitudes. Um, oh, well anyway, uh, I'll go ahead and pause while I do this. You guys, I'm sure, don't want to watch me do this part, because it's kind of repetitive so I'll be right back all right guys so I just finished off fighting that Eevee and I shouldn't have enough um, enough candies here to get ice up to level let's see maybe Ooh, maybe not nope Oh, 
Well, definitely not when you give it to Pam. Okay, Pam's level 55 now. That's cool. <sighs> I actually don't know what I'm going to end up giving him. Alright, I'll be back. So I just gave him some candies, and we are now evolving ice. I think that's what I wanted to do. I don't know. I'll figure it out, I'm sure. Now let's do this right. Uh, 46. Still not quite there. I'll be right back again. Alright, and we are on the way back after training up, getting him to level. I wish Pam wasn't way above my team now but obviously the first thing we have to do ice boy what do we have roar of ale powder snow leafage mist ice shard razor leaf ice wind and swagger um no I like I like how we have it set up with We've got Blizzard and Ingrain, then we have Woodhammer and Ice Punch. Woodhammer, the only downside of Woodhammer is that it is going to do damage to me. So I'm kind of wondering if it might be better to use like Razor Leaf or something, but let's see what I have for TMs. <coughs> have not healed yet. Metronome. Sludge Wave. User strikes everything around it by swamping the area with a giant sludge wave. This may also poison those hit. 95, 100. I mean, he's not great with special attack. Eh, it's not worth it. I suppose I never checked what Charizard could learn either. But that's... Partially lures the user's special attack stat. I mean, it's strong. I think we saw Fire Pledge with it. I know that's weird. But, just to have that powerful hit, if we need it, he waved 9590, nah. Oh, we can learn Substitute, isn't that great? He can learn Grass Knot and Energy Ball, but he's physical. He can learn Rock Tomb. Not really feeling that. Steel wing. Okay, well, we're gonna stick with what we got. Heal up. Look at that team. Mm-hmm. That is a team. 
Aaron, buddy. Alright, we're gonna swap ice to the top. Move him around like that. Drow Dawn to use my spot. Oh, and we need to give ice something to use, an item. No leftovers on this team. Lotto ID, maybe we'll get another Moomoo Milk. Matches someone. Last digit. Always the Moomoo Milk. We got plenty of full restores. We got some hyper potions. We got a bunch of max potions. Oh, look, we could just buy quick balls here. Not that we're really going to need them anymore. Uh, but we might end up selling all of what we have and just buying up some uh, some of these bad boys. What do you have to say? All right. Um, well, like Hop said, off to the stadium we go. Which is not this way, is it? It is this way. Okay, I had it right. I was like, this doesn't seem right. There's pathways off to the side, but it is. Oh, look at these guys. Let's go. It's time. Whoa, ball guy. The dream ball. Makes it easier to catch wild Pokemon if they're asleep. That's pretty cool. That banging music. Semi-finals. Woohoo! I think we're ready. Oh, is it versus Marnie? It is. Oh, I won't take it personal when you kick my butt, Marnie. Lipard is just dark, I believe. Coming at you with everything I got, she says. Yep, got that paralysis off. Still got a snarl through. It's fine, Charizard eats it. Leon eats it. Did 30 damage. Now we're gonna throw an air slash. 
How did it move first? Lipard's still alive. This thing. Here we go. It begins. I'll just drop another flamethrower. Oh. We'll hit it with Dragon Breath. I have nothing to say. That was just tedious. That was the most tedious live hard fight I've ever had in my entire life. Tim grows level 52 and Leon to 51. Very nice. Morpico! Oh, sorry about that. Just knocking you guys around. Uh, Pico is electric dark, so we switch. Being electric and dark. I think Pam's the move. And yes, I know, overleveled. Sorry, didn't mean to. Yeah, doesn't affect me. That was the predict. Now we earthquake. Should take it out. We're gonna get tormented. Earthquake. Finishes off more Pico. A Scrafty is fighting? So we can use superpower on it. Pam doesn't need to be fast, so okay. Scrafty's down. Toxicroak. Earthquake. I'm like, what can I use against a Toxicroak? Wow. Marnie actually hit me for once. Good Pam. After the Rocky Helmet, Earthquake's definitely gonna one shot. Unless he's got like sturdy or something, or like the, the sturdy effects from the item he's holding. But he doesn't. That's that. Ice grows to level 52. Well, I know I had it set up to record two videos today, but seeing as how we're this close... Well, no, there's still quite a bit of the game left to do. I don't know. Uh, Grimmsnarl. Grimmsnarl. Just gonna Gigantamax. Didn't rise as their last, but uh, that's alright. Gigantamax Grim Snarl. <laughs> Stamina boosting me up. Defense rises. We're gonna hit it with a heavy slam. Pam shook its head. <sighs> okay, Pam. That's fine.
I'll send out Duraladon, Pam. Wow. After all this time, Pam was just like, nah. I don't want to help you. I think this is his last turn as a uh, Gigantamax, so we go big. I think we survive whatever it throws at us. Still spot. Whoa. That was cool to see. Grim Snarls down in the yellow. We gain some defense. Starfall again. Should be fine. Ah, uh, yeah. Tickles. And we hit it with another Steel Spike. We beat Marnie! Seven thousand eight hundred forty buckaroonies. Everyone in the stadium was watching us during all that. I heard them cheering for me and my Pokemon. It was nice. I may have lost, but at least we drove the audience wild. Guess that's not so bad. I'll join with my brothers in the stands and watch from the sidelines see who wins. Blah blah blah. Tim, I've been waiting for you the final match. I'll see you the way you're headed. I can't accept the outcome besides winning this match. My team is on fire. Oh, so I'm up against top next, huh? Oh, no, no, no. Pardon me. I know you didn't get a long break, but the match before yours ended more quickly than expected. Challenger hop won quite handedly. So as soon as you're ready, we'd like to get you back on the pitch. My team's fully healed. All right. I don't know who I'm up against though. It's gonna be me and Hop, huh? Okay. <sighs> Alright, let's go. Wait. Yeah. You could have named her Bertha. Hop's gonna lead with his Wulu, right? I think Hop always leads with the Bull. So I'm gonna start off with, uh, with Tim. Let's see. <laughs> wow, I hope it doesn't actually look as choppy as it does on my screen. That's really weird. And I don't like that at all. It's like I'm recording in 30 frames per second right now. <laughs> All right, he's ready. Ooh, and he started with the pool, which is what I called. Um, Cotton Guard, huh?
half. Or not half, uh, half what I thought. Hit me. Zen head, ooh, that's not good. Okay, that's fine. Revenge. So now it should do double. Yep. We'll use revenge again. Zen headbutt. Very nice. Zen headbutt one more time. And we'll just revenge him one more time. Finishes off his Dabool. Leon grew to level 52. He sends out Snorlax. What can Snorlax do to me? Heavy Slam. Steel. Alright, it hurts it hurts a little, but we'll just revenge him. We'll heal up. <laughs> Heavy slam. Yeah, it doesn't do a whole lot. There, hop. We'll revenge again. Brought me down to 45 again. I'm going to use revenge and finish him off. Goodbye, Snorlax. Tim grew to level 53. Pin Urchin. I don't know what this is. I'm really hoping it's not as, as terribly choppy as it appears to be. Here's a drill run. What does Curse even do? Scissor. Should finish it off before it gets any hits on me. That was really weird. That was really weird. I don't know why he was just setting up so much. Corviknight. We need to swap out for that. And see, that's why I didn't uh, didn't do the other thing that I was going to do. Pokemon. Uh, Leon can handle this Corviknight quite handedly because a flamethrower. Steel, it's gonna hurt hard. None of those flying attacks are gonna hit me very hard. Yeah, drill peck. Nope. Have one of these. Bye bye, Corviknight. What is his G-Max? Guzma grew to level 52. Oh, he doesn't G-Max, he just Dynamaxes his Inteladon, which we're swapping out for. 
We're gonna swap right out to ice. Look at him go. Getting his Intelladon on. He gets a free hit on me. Tanked it like a boss. But he made it rain. Which means they're gonna do more damage. But that's fine. Because we're gonna hit him with the max overgrowth. Just the way you were intended to defeat that Intelladon. Except it would have been Grandpa. Not, uh. Not this. Not ice. Who's faster? Max Hailstorm on an ice type? Why? That's confusing. Uh, maybe he's going for the freeze. I don't know. Seems odd. But Intelladon is done. One shot. Leon grows to 53, Duraludon grows to 54, and wants to learn Flash Cannon, which is a special steel move, which is going to replace Metal Claw. Don't get too upset there, Hop. Don't get too upset there. I don't know what's going on with my frame rate right now. I did real well, thank you. Head to Winden Stadium if you're ready. First question. We're gonna be real button mache and just say the ones they want you to say. Okay. Team is good. We didn't lose anyone. This is where we're going to end this episode with this really weird choppy 
I don't know what's going on. But anyway, I'm going to end this episode here. And, uh, well, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thank you guys for watching.